Yeah, so I don't know what happened here, but this is just ridiculous. I mean, Apple had uh, you know problems with iMovie updates for years, a few years back. The last few, you know, four or five years have been going pretty good with Apple. The last version before this one, iMovie had some crashing, some weird things, started getting a little oddball again, you know. But now with this 10.15.6 update, you know, it just came out like two days ago. Uh, this is just ridiculous. And uh, see here the version yeah, two days ago. So, yeah, they did, you know, got to this, improved stability. But what they don't mention is it broke a ton of vital things. So this is a MacBook Pro 15-inch uh, 2016 for the record. First thing is if I add, you know, add uh, footage here, like here, um, you'll see my controls up here are, are active. But if I click on a clip, they all go blanco. I can't edit sound, um, colors, speed, whatever. Now, what's oddball is if I um, if I click right before the the clip, I can then click speed. And I can click like slow, but then it all goes gray. You see it slowed it down, but it all went gray. Now I can then go back, click speed again. Oops. First I got to, okay, it's another weird thing. You first have to click in your main footage area, your new footage. Then you have to click back again. Then it will like reset so you can then, then go click speed again and turn this back or preserve pitch or whatever you want to do. So you got to do everything like five times to do what you could do before, like in one you know, step. So something's oddball here. You see these things are going off. And uh, OK, great. So I thought, well, I could work around that for now. So, well, you know, let's crop in on this on this airplane here. You know, it's easy. You just click crop and then you would select here and you crop in. You could do Ken Burns, whatever. It's gone. You can't crop. It just doesn't work. I tried a million things. It doesn't work. Oh, yeah, Apple, look, this is a big one. Watch. If, you're, if I'm, like, right here. So I can't, uh, you know, if I, if, if you add a new clip or do something and you try to go back and, like, oh, I want to preview something else or even that what you just added, it won't show you the preview and it won't play with hitting spacebar. So then with the, the workaround is you just click up here on something in your, uh, where your videos are, your clips that you've uh, uploaded, and you click back here. You see here, then the, it plays, uh, and then it previews. So that's another, it's like that was the first thing that alerted me, something's oddball. And there's more things like that. This is thing, like an, another little example, very irritating problem. All right, so now the, 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 the big problem is I want to share. So I go up here to, to share. And I click YouTube. It's all 4K. Always worked 4K before with this with these the, this camera. It is 4K, but now I can't choose anything other than large or 480p. I mean, come on now. All right, so I grab my little description here. I thought, well, it gets all oddball. I, then I can't click anything else. I can't get to the tags or anything. You have to like delete this so you can go add tags first. You can't see the full name of the file unless you scroll. Uh, I guess you can. So yeah, this doesn't work. Luckily, I can still export file and it doesn't even have 4K, but okay, 1080p, 60, fine, you know. Uh, good enough for this type of stuff, but for my work, you know, I need I need the top quality stuff, and this is just not cutting it. Um, so yeah, now I can add in, but you see now, yeah, you see right away the problem. You can kind of see tags like that. And it doesn't really matter for the file. I always do it in the file too because, um, yeah, I don't know. Um, 
And then that's that's a way to get around this whole iMovie bugaroon, you know, situation here. It's just one, Apple, please fix this, or someone tell me what I'm doing wrong. I don't know. Uh, I might have to figure out how to go back a version. That might be the next uh, problem here, or next, uh, you know, assignment is figure out how to go back a version. So basically, hold off on updating to the to the iMovie um, on the latest version. Oops. And that would be uh, 10.1.15. So you want to go back to 10.1.14 or whatever it is. This is just a, a, a bug-filled situation, at least on the MacBook Pro. If you're having problems, please let me know. I want to hear what they are, what types of systems you're running. And I uh, hope Apple sees this or gets reports of this and is fixing it right, you know, right away like it should be. This is just really unacceptable. I mean, come on. Anyway. Apple's great guys, you know, I don't want to be too hard on them, but this is something, I mean, to go to, to get out the door with this many bugs, you know, it just seems un unbelievable. Unless there's something really awful with my machine. I don't know. Anyway, please let me know if you're having issues. Thank you.